Hello, my name is Immaculate Stories. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed my last video. Remember, I told you last time that everyone has got a gift. You might be asking, What is my own gift? What is my own gift? You want to know my gift? My gift. As I'm sitting down here, I am telling you, my gift is caring for children from babies until they become adults, until they finish their university and set them up for life. That is my gift. When I say it's my gift, how I look at it and I view my life as a gift. Everywhere I go, the children, babies, whether they are able to talk or not, the moment they set their eyes on me, they will look again. Who is that? Without me telling them who I am. Without even me say hello to them. The moment they saw me, they say, oh no. They feel like, yes, I saw somebody. I saw somebody. Who is that? And they will look again. And I will look back to the, at them and smile. And they will also respond. And they will fix their eyes on me. Some of them, they, their mom or their, their parents will be holding them. But they will be looking back and looking at me. I work with the children society. I work with the children in, in my church. I work with them as a professional. I work in the school sectors or education sectors. I work with children. I love to see the children happy. I love to see the children to discover who they are. I love to see that they are okay and they are happy. I love to see that they eat what they want and they are happy and they enjoy it. And they are thankful too. I love to be with the children 24 hours. That is, um, that is not an issue with me. People say, oh, children, too much noise. They, that. that is never with me. I don't know how I can endure that. If every place I walk, I see people stress up because of children. But I, I feel like, what is a big deal about that? There's children, and they can only be children once. <laughs> After that, no more. So God has given me the knowledge about children, babies, children, young adults, um, teenagers. In such a way that step by step, I know what to do. I know how they feel. I know what help they needed to, what progress they need to be, what level they need to be in life. I love to push them. I love to challenge them. I love to pull things out of them. I love to bring that what is inside them out so that they can see it and go for it. And when I talk to children, they respond positively to what I say to them. They feel happy. As I was on day, I went to the library. I saw this child is just very unbearable to people. I just look at, took a look at him. The librarian was very upset, almost like, I, we can't take it anymore, we need to tell the parents to remove him from the library session. I saw this boy. I took him, I said, look at him. I come. What is your name? He told me his name. I guess, okay, sit down. I need to talk to you. He sat down. I talked to, uh, and I began to talk to him. I began to lay down the kind of things she has done and the people are not happy around. And then I began to pull out the desire. I began to draw a picture of who he can be to him. I did not consult the parents. I did not consult anybody. 
I just feel I should do it as you talk to him. And I sat him and talked to him. To my greatest surprise, the next time I saw him, he was a changed boy. Happy, sitting down, reading, instead of pulling the books from the shelf. Oh my God, it's amazing. Just to talk to a child, you didn't even give the child uh, uh, millions of pounds, millions of dollars. But this child was able to do something. I did not do anything other than draw his picture so that he can see the type of person he's supposed to be, not what he's trying to be now. Because at home, he might be facing kind of issue. Because more importantly, because growing up as children, you can face trouble hormones. The hormones are fighting you to be, to grow up, to become somebody. If you don't handle children properly, you will lose them totally for life. That's why we have a lot of them on the street. And I, some of them, I am not happy. You see a big, young, handsome boy, you could say, this one, one day can be a prime minister, you know. This one, one day can be a queen of England, you know. But what they behave, how they do, how they talk, ah, it's so, so bad. Sometimes I start them to tell them, this is what you're supposed to say. This is who you are supposed to be, not what you are trying to show off. There's nothing to show for. Lay your brain, lay your smartness, tell you who you are. Not going about kicking people, standing on people way, pushing them. We can't do that. So my gift is that to, to recognize what is inside a child. I begin to work with this child. I can walk you daily if you want me. Unfortunately, it's not every of the children I can talk to them twice. But the one who they are reasonable, they will hear you once and they will go about and get it done. It was my greatest surprise to see this boy just transform. Transformed in one talk. Oh, amazing. So there is a gift inside you. Maybe it's to talk to people to make them feel good. Maybe it's to talk to people and make them feel good. One good thing I observe my, myself is I talk to whether adult or children, any age, any religion. I don't have a religion mindset to say, oh, this one is a Muslim, I can't talk. This one, you know, is for me, I can't talk. Oh, this one from this country, I can't talk. That is not an issue. Is to look at people and be able to help them. We all need help. Please, we all need help. Help me so that I can help other people. Share my video. Subscribe. Like. Let somebody know that they have something. Let their talent not be wasted. Even if it is little. Even if you save somebody, one person, it is too great in God's sight. Is very, very great. We are all important to God. Whether you are able, whether you are disabled, whether you are dyslexic, whatever thing you want to classify yourself, you are very good for that situation. You've got to turn it around. I told you, when you continue to listen and watch my videos, you will soon know the truth behind what I am making this video for. Stay tuned to my channel and God bless you.